You're watching Vanish Need for Speed. Yo, what's that? Someone is getting a ticket when the cop shows up. Yeah. You just gotta make sure it's not you. Cars just makes it feel like they're alive. We usually uh, just, we wait till the cop gets here. Y'all see. You guys will see. And as we set out looking for that answer, we even got caught in the chaos. All right, give me your license oh. and insurance. I'm gonna... A constant battle between the police and thousands of drivers creates the most active street racing scene in America. This is the Chicago street racing community. To give context to our experience, we're going to need a little history. Chicago, home to jazz, wind, this monstrosity, and the first ever American automobile race. With prizes totaling near $5,000, Chicago unknowingly started a revolution of motor mania. The winner clocked the 54 mile race in seven hours and 53 minutes. Two years later, America industrialized the car and transportation exploded. Fast forward a few more years and the great city of Chicago wanted to stay up to date with this expansion. So, in 1906, the city built a road three stories underneath the belly of the beast to bypass all of the city traffic. This deep transport tunnel is known as Lower Wacker Drive. Remember these? As you can see, it looks as if it were built for car chases and underground racing. Which may not have been the intent, but today, many use it as such. Making Lower Wacker Drive the epicenter of the Chicago street racing community. This central meetup location right underneath this thriving urban landscape means anyone with any kind of car can participate. The Kanjo. A 7.68 kilometer long loop of connected highways that encircle the city of Osaka. For most, it's their daily commute. For some, it's another noisy highway that runs through the middle of their neighborhood. But for the Kanjozoku, it's the loop where friendships and rivalries are formed. Welcome to their automotive playground. <laughs> The Civic is as much a part of Kanjo culture as the highway loop itself. The Kanjozoku explain why, out of the abundance of cars Japan is known for, this little economy car from Honda became their weapon of choice. Civic, 
よく曲がる、まあ、僕らももともとその FRFR FR の例えばまあ86レビンとかあんなも乗ったけどもうこれはもう乗ったらもうやみつきになってまう車やねえから、うん、魅力のある車やね、うん、ずっとシビックを見てきたわけですけど乗って初めて分かったのが。やっぱりあの V テクエンジンすり抜けに必要なのクイックさそれでその格上の車と勝負できるっていう部分がやっぱりやるかもしれないなんですかシビックは阪神高速は感情はもう一般車も多くてその中でもすり抜けしやすい車の幅が短いから走りやすい一番シビックにしかない魅力がありますルーツは結局大阪、関西、鈴鹿サーキットがある鈴鹿サーキットっていうのは昔からシビックのワンメイクレースがずっと行われているところでもともとその要はシビックのワンメイクかっていうのを感情に持ってきたっていうのが一番最初だから結局関西ですごいその JDM をリアル JDM っていうのは、まあ、発信は全部関西で日本全国でてもこれだけシビックホンダ車が盛んなのは関西なんですよ。Originally used to reference products coming out of Japan, the term JDM now largely refers to Japanese automotive culture and style in general. The Kanjozoku, however, begged to differ. あのー、表に出ている JDM と呼ばれるもの。